You've heard of snakes on a plane? Have you heard of snakes on an Ikea? Oh man, this guy's feisty. He is one feisty snake. He is relentless. Get him, Ikea man. Go Ikea man, get him. Oh yeah, that's it. There's two of the Ikea men. They're going for it. Have you seen how these guys just like spin around? They should be perfect at catching snakes or wrangling snakes. Does this snake actually hurt? Ow, ow. Yeah, he does. Okay, I need something to fight snakes with. A Harry Potter wand. That's got to be the thing. Okay, I'm going to go for green sparks. Oh, take this. Here, get him. Get him. Why is that doing nothing? Why are the sparks doing nothing? Okay, that's not bad. I don't even know if you can actually destroy these snakes. I think they're unstoppable. All we've done is just destroy this Ikea. This fantastic homewares store has just been wrecked. Whoa, that was pretty cool. I need this one. Immobilis. 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 Yeah, that worked. I think I'm in trouble for setting fire to Ikea. Oh, big snake. This one is giant. I'll make a few of these guys. There we go. Hey, champs. How's it going? I'm gonna make a run for it. I'm gonna make a run past the snakes. Oh, jeez. That guy is brave. He is so brave. Oh, the snakes are bashing him up. <laughs> Run! Run, they're coming! Oh, no way! These things are just like this crazy destructive force. Look at them all! Oh, oh dude. I'm so sorry about this. I'm so sorry. Hey, he doesn't care that much. So it's been a while since I played Teardown. So many people have been asking me to play this game again. I went back and I found a stack of mods. There's been a few since I last played it. Oh man. Okay, if these snakes catch me, I'm dead for sure. Although I can sidestep them. They're not very good. I do have something called Cinematic Bomb. Let's chuck that thing down. See if we can set that thing off. Yes! That's the move! Yeah! Okay, that's the move that killed me. <laughs> I died. Finn Pryor killed in a freak Ikea explosion. Some snakes were involved. Excuse me, Mr. Robot Ikea man. Where are the hot dogs? I hear the hot dogs are really good and they cost like a dollar. All right, I'm looking for the hot dogs. Tyrannosaurus Rex. Okay. Whoa. Yeah, T-Rex in an Ikea. So cinematic. T-Rex is coming. <laughs> Jeez. He does not care for cost effective budget homewares. Maybe it's the flat packs and the fact that you have to build it yourself just makes him really cranky. Yeah, just, he's just smashing down everything. Or maybe he's just annoyed he can't find the hot dogs. This is the tool like in, uh, it's kind of like Astroneer, I guess. You can just build stuff. Oh, his jaw came off. It's just, who's wrecking who? I can't tell. Okay, that's a fine. I've got a little bit of time. I've got a little bit of time. Hey champ, how do you feel about T-Rexes? No, you don't need to build these ones yourself. There, there he is. There's a T-Rex! He's right behind you! you might... Don't run towards the T-Rex! It is so cinematic! It is very good! Oh man! What's a ragdoll gun? Oh hey! You can fire little dudes! Just don't do his mouth! You can feed him like little people like popcorn! Oh jeez. Can you fart on a T-Rex? Oh that did a bit of damage to his skin! Hot dogs! Hot dogs! Hot dogs! No hot dogs. I'm just gonna get this plank. This'll stop him. Let's just get a plank from there to there. He can't proceed past the... Pl he can. He just kicked the plank out of the way like it was nothing. It's cinematic bomb time. All right, I'm just gonna stand over here. We're gonna let the bomb do the work. Slow-mo style. Oh, he just kicked it. He just kicked the bomb. This is gonna be one of those moments in a movie where you don't know if it actually killed the bad guy. Oh, there's an Ikea guy right there. He's walking towards the explosions. That guy is a true hero to Ikea in Sweden. Where- Oh! We blew him in half! There's half a T-Rex there! We destroyed him! But at what cost? About $5.99, I imagine. Hey, but you still have to build it yourself. Hey, it's a friendly snake! That's nice! Get in the catapult! <laughs> You're being catapulted, snake! I'm just gonna grab him by the head. There we go. How can we attach him to the catapult? Oh, that's pretty good. Just get him right in there. You sit in that catapult bit, okay? Ugh. Get right in there like that, and then ugh, launch! Off he goes! Yeah! Into the acid pit. There goes the snake. I know that was a happy snake, I just wanted to get some revenge on snakes in general. Just the entire species. <laughs> Where is this guy going? Come on, get in the catapult thingy. I don't know what that bit's called. The launchy bit? I don't know. Okay, he's in there. Increase the tension to 100%. And... Fire! Whoa! Whoa! Launched him good! He's going into the acid! 
Oh, we almost cleared it. Can we get a few of these guys in here? See if we can launch a couple of chips. Catapult buddies for life. Three, two, one. Yup. <laughs> oh no, one of them hit the end there. Oh, you can grab this thing and you can push it and it changes the direction of the catapult. What if I can launch one of these cinematic bombs? Yeah, there we go. Or will it blow up the catapult? I don't know, let's find out. Oh no, it launched it. Bang, yeah, nice. What a cool explosion. Can we get a car in there? I feel like we can get a car in there. All right, and go. Oh, not bad, it's not bad. Oh, the camera, from, the camera mode's not working anymore. That's a shame. Okay, that could be one of the coolest vehicles I've ever seen. Yeah. <laughs> this is an amazing vehicle. <laughs> Look at this guy, it's so fast. Okay. All right, let's, let's see how far we can actually jump over the acid pit. Yes, just launches himself right over it. Didn't even hit the ground. I reckon I can probably get this guy to follow me into the acid, right? Hang on, let's just jump in my cool little car here. Let's go. Oh yeah, try and catch me, champ. Come on, you can't catch me, Mr. T-Rex. I'm calling him Tyrone. Tyrone the T-Rex. Let's go. Let's go. How am I gonna get him to go into the acid? Just gotta take him up the ramp. I look like a person who's already been in the acid. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, I'm just, I'm missing all my skin and my flesh. All right. Yep. Yep. Just gotta, ow, 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 ow. Come on, come on. Oh, oh, I just gotta survive. I died. Oh, he's still there. I just gotta shove him in. Gotta shove him in. Oh, he's coming back down. Do I have any shoving things? Okay, I got a magic wand. We have Flipendo. Oh, he just ate it. I think he ate my Flipendo. Wow, that's pretty incredible. When you think about it, guy just eats magic. It's not very strong. It kind of just lifts the nose of a bus. It is Sonic versus the T-Rex. Let's go. Oh, he just chewed me to bits. Big time. T-Rex is just eating Sonic. Look at that, Sonic guts everywhere. Okay, I think I need another catapult. I could possibly catapult the T-Rex into the acid. Oh, he just kicked my catapult. Ah, I've lifted him up off the ground and seized his body into the sky. Okay, I'm just gonna throw this one away. I actually broke it. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna do my best to launch this T-Rex into the ocean of acid. All right, and go, launch. Just launch! Oh, I think I slapped him in the chin! He landed in the acid though! He actually landed in the acid! You can see chunks of T-Rex. He is gone. Good job, Catapult. I wonder who would win between a boss and a T-Rex though. Okay, where's that T-Rex? I'm gonna smack into him. Oh, there he is. There he is! Oh, man, that is one hard T-Rex. Yeah, he just crumpled the front of my bus. He ate it like I was a giant loaf of bread or something. Flame on! Oh, barely even took the skin off him. I do have a talk bow though. Here we go. Got to get him right in the mouth for it to be effective. Oh, there goes his head. We took him down. Nailed it. And here we have a toilet with poo raining out of it. So I'm just gonna just gonna put that in there. See if we can launch this thing in the catapult. All right, this one's gonna be a good one. It's gonna be a good one. Whoa, there it goes. <laughs> it's just streaming out of there. Get inside the porta potty. There we go. You just hang out in there. I'm just gonna close the door on you there, champ. Yeah, that's right. Stinks a little bit in the porta potty. Ragdoll man is in the porta potty. Let's go, champ. Oh, there he goes. Yes, yes, launching him good. Camera mode is working. And he's destroyed. Okay, just because I figured you guys would ask for it, I'm doing it. Snakes on a plane. This is happening. All right, let's go. We'll just spawn a bunch of snakes. This seems like a terrible idea. They're already destroying the cabin and the people and just come over that guy just got wrecked. Get out of the way, the snakes! Where is Samuel Jackson? I'm just gonna close this curtain. All right, sir, you stay on that side. Sir, no, this is first class. You guys are economy passengers, get back there. This is for high society. Okay, I'm probably gonna have to hide in the, uh, the pilot's cabin. I'm not gonna lie. Ugh. Come on, let me in. Let me in, where's the pilots? All right, let's just close this door and pretend the snakes don't exist. Hey, I'm flying the plane now. <laughs> just outside the door. <laughs> they look like they're actually making themselves comfortable. You know what I mean? Like, oh, can I please get a martini? I don't know if you get martinis on a plane. Oh no, oh no. Decompression. This is bad, this is bad. Although, hang on, it might be good. Maybe the snakes will get dragged outside of the plane. Nah, 
No, they're still coming for me. Ow, ow, I've been bit. I've been bit. This is just like Australian Airlines. We have snakes on our planes. Oh, ouch. Ouchies. This is why you don't fart on a plane, guys. Oh, you can't destroy these snakes at all. Even with farts. Oh, hang on. No, 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 no. That snake's dead. All right. This is it. Just gonna shred them. Shred them to bits. Got the great gun. That's what I'm talking about. Okay, but what about T-Rex on a plane? Is that a thing? Can we do the T-Rex on the plane? <laughs> it sort of works. It doesn't quite have the same effect as snakes on a plane. Are you are you alive, bro? Oh, I think he, I think he died. I, th I think he died. Turns out T-Rexes on a plane is just bad for the T-Rex. Not bad for the people at all. Look at this guy. He's like, yeah, I don't even care. You want to get a photo? What's that? Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's get a photo of you in the T-Rex's mouth. Yeah, look at that. This goes straight on Instagram. Hang on there, champ. I'm going to need the physics gun for this one. Open up, T-Rex. Open up. Yeah, there we go. Look at that. Someone take a photo. Done. I wonder if it's possible to actually spawn a T-Rex and the T-Rex not die. Oh, no, he's alive. Whoa. Oh, decompression. That's bad. <laughs> He's just... Oh, no! There he goes! Oh, that's sad times for the T-Rex. Okay, this might actually work. Let's try this. Yeah, that works! T-Rex is actually on a plane. See that? Whoa, 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 whoa. Jeez, that guy hurts when he bites. So much. Whoa, look at all the crap flying out of the plane. Whoa! I've got almost nowhere to go. Where am I gonna go? I feel like Tom Cruise. Mission Impossible 18. I'm getting all the way up here. What are you gonna do about it, T-Rex? Yeah, you can't get me, champ. Can you climb? I don't think you can climb. Have a cinematic bomb. Have a couple, in fact. Oh, yeah, just shredded into pieces. Okay, I really like that bomb. That's definitely one of the best bombs in the game. 